People think the herb is actually doing the killing. A lot of time, the herbs are actually recruiting and it's giving a signal to your body. So your white blood cell becomes more active and they go kill the bad guys more efficiently. So when you do that, your immune system is being recruited more efficiently. Then it's going to go after the bad guys and not go after your own bacteria because your immune system recognizes self tissue bacteria. Your own microbiome is recognized by your immune system as, hey, this is part of the bacteria that's been here since the day I was born. It's part of my microbiome. So it tend to leave it alone because if it didn't, then you're constantly having an infection where your immune system is constantly killing off your own bacteria. But that's not the case. It has some tolerance to self tissue bacteria. It still need to control the beneficial bacteria. It still need to control it so it doesn't overgrow, but it tends to have more tolerance. And so the herb is really supporting your immune system to kill the bugs, to get your body to do it. And therefore, it's going to go after the bad guys and not touch the good guys as much. So for those reasons, antimicrobial herbs tend to not damage or kill off your own beneficial bacteria like an antibiotic would.